properly drying patty rice can avoid huge losses. When your rice is not dried properly, you can lose crop to mold, pests, and other issues. Patty drying is difficult, especially during rainy and cloudy days. This is why it is best to use a dryer for your crop. The BAU STR dryer can be used even on rainy days because of its design. The BAU STR is an efficient batch dryer device. It is low cost to make and run, and it reduces labor costs and health risks. The BAU STR dryer is comprised of a blower, an inner bin, an outer bin, a hot air conveyor pipe, and a stove. The inner bin and outer bin sit on any plain floor. The blower will be on top of the inner bin of the dryer. The stove is placed beside the grain bin and a steel conveyor pipe connects stove and axial flow blower for hot air flow. The grain should be placed evenly in the empty space between the inner bin and the outer bin. A polythene sheet covers the patty to protect hot air leaking upward. A rice husk briquette chopped into 2.5 centimeter long pieces is used as fuel for the stove. Electricity is required for running the blower. One option is a fuel operated generator. One third of the upper chamber of the stove is filled with chopped rice husk briquettes and the stove is fired. Then the blower is started. Rice husk briquettes are fed in the stove every four to five minutes for a continuous heat supply. The blower sucks the hot air from the stove through the steel conveyor pipe and blows the air into the inner bin of the dryer. This process will dry the patty. The temperature of hot air blowing to the patty bin should not exceed 43 degrees Celsius to maintain quality of patty for seed purpose. The temperature is maintained below 50 degrees Celsius for patty used for consumption. To get a better quality of head rice recovery, tempering for four to five hours after drying is required. By using the BAU STR dryer, you'll decrease your labor costs and increase the quality of yield for your crop.